Davy was a genuine star. The Royal Institution Theatre was packed with the great and the good of the day. They had come to witness Davy's spectacular demonstrations. It had all the excitement of a magic show, but what Davy was doing was better than magic. It was chemistry. Davy's experiments were often spectacular. He even burned diamonds to demonstrate that these most precious gems are made of carbon, the same stuff as coal. To Davy's audience, this was captivating. Here, in front of their eyes, he was demonstrating one of the latest scientific theories that everything is made up of a limited number of elements. Davy was famous for doing spectacular experiments, in particular for blowing things up. In fact, it said that he was something of a pyromaniac. And this is one of the experiments. It's involving iodine, which is in fact one of the elements Davy is famous for discovering. So, Davy mixed iodine this liquid, and what happens is a powerful contact explosive is made. And in one of his experiments, he temporarily blinded himself by doing just what I'm doing now. Now, what Davy wanted to do is to educate his audience. He wanted to show them that chemistry was exciting and counterintuitive, this idea that you can make compounds out of other substances that have extremely surprising and, in this case, spectacular properties. Nitrogen triiodide is a wonderful compound for demonstrating those ideas. It's basically a nitrogen atom with three iodines stuck to it. Now, nitrogen atoms want to interact. They want to bond together into the very stable nitrogen molecule. But the iodines keep them just far enough apart that they can't interact. All you have to do to change that and make them interact very quickly indeed is to give them a little tickle. And it really is a very little tickle. And <laughs> <laughs> look at that. And that purple vapor there is iodine. So that was a very rapid chemical reaction. Nitrogen is produced and iodine is released. Yeah, see why Davy liked that. What Davy was demonstrating is that acquiring and applying scientific knowledge gives us power over nature. <laughs> <laughs>